cfcl.com slash twiki slash bin slash edit slash capital P projects slash twiki meetup demo capital TW capital M capital D um, so there was a there was a sort of a questionnaire came out and they said who the heck are you and why are you here so I've been using twiki since mid uh, 2003 um, I've been using Twiki at a couple of companies. I've lost this again, haven't I? This is embarrassing. I should be using my own laptop. There we go. I've been using Twiki since mid-2003. I've got my own personal Twiki that I put together. One's at work, one's at home. Twiki at the previous job, Twiki now at the current job. Um, everybody at the current job can use Twiki, so the question of how many users we have is an unknown because they might use it once, they might use it a lot. We just don't know. There's about 18,000 registered. And they just, as soon as they, they connect for the first time, it knows who they are, so it's all magic. Um, I work at Yahoo. You've probably heard of us. Uh, we've got 985 webs at last count, 321,000 pages. What is that? Five million page views in October. Not quite a million page edits, and our performance really stinks. My team is the people who support things like Yahoo Finance, Yahoo Sports. We've got our own web because that made it a lot easier and we could control what we do. We have about uh, not quite 1,100 pages at this point and 41 users. And it's kind of nice because we're part of the rest of it, but we're also in charge of our own stuff. Um, we have customer-facing documentation, a whole bunch of team documentation. We do project management, which if I have time, I will hit, because that's the magic. Um, that's our front page. So I tried to make it look cute. Um, cute is nice. And those are, all, those are all links. That's using a plugin called RenderList plugin, which I think is very cute, because it lets you do things that are bullets, but they've got cute little, uh, cute little icons on top of them. So what we had a while back, I've been using one of these uh, Twiki applications. I started using it a short while ago because what happened was we were getting a whole lot of projects launching and running and we really didn't have any good way to manage them that we'd come up with in my group. And we needed a whole bunch of uh, multiple documents, review forms, <coughs> kickoff forms, launch forms, just lots of things that were all connected. And the people in the group said, well, why don't you come up with a naming convention like we'll say this is finance launch two and we'll just name everything with that in it. We have this unfortunate problem that people have a tendency to keep renaming the project two or three times during the run of the project. Anybody's company do that? Um, so of course we'd have to rename 15 different pages and we'd go mad. And I said, well, I've always wanted to learn about Twiki applications and forms, and this sounds like an ideal opportunity, so why don't you people just let me go off and I'll work something up. Um, so that's what I did. And uh, it's, it's a suite because I'm afraid I do suites. That's, that's me. I always do that. So we've got a whole bunch of stuff. We've got, oh, my core passions are communication and process, and when you put them together, you get documentation and things like this. So I have this big mammoth meta documentation thing um, that lives over top of this entire tracking process because I can't stand it otherwise. So we have documents. And these are our documents. You don't have to know what you're seeing here, just the fact that there's a whole bunch of them going by. And these are part of this application process that I put together because I need to be able to track my own project, which is to handle the project, right? Um, and we've got the form definition, and we've got the project page, and we've got all the little supplementary things, and we do our project management, and we have zillions of tricky twicks, tricky, tricky, tricky tricks. <laughs> uh, say that three times fast, yes. Okay, so we've got the, uh, we got the forms, um, the include variable or macro or whatever you want to call it is one of the marvelous Twiki things. If you haven't used Twiki or you've started using it and you don't know about include, go learn about it because it lets us put things here and use them there. And one of the things I've done is a lot of common code. So I have one chunk and all my project pages read from this, but it's exactly <coughs> the same thing everywhere. So if somebody says, oh, gee, gosh, we want to have one more line, I edit one place and 35 pages change. 
that is incredibly wonderful because I got really tired of opening those 31 pages and changing them every time so I don't have to anymore. I can show you quickly the plugins. Um, I don't have to go all the way through them, but these are some of the plugins that we use, most of which sort of come with a standard Twiki uh, implementation anyway. Um, comment plugin I'm madly in love with when you the simplest thing to say about comment plugin is it's this little teeny box, you type your comment in it, you hit the button and poof it shows up on the, on the screen, you don't have to go through an edit cycle. But if you play with it, you can get down in behind and you can do really fancy things with comment plugin to do pull down menus and radio buttons and check boxes and fill ins and all kinds of stuff very, very simply and easily and they're right there on the page and you click things. And So the idea with this was that as I was telling Carol earlier, we wanted to be able to hand a page, how did I get here? We wanted to be able to hand a page to people and say, okay, um, here's your page and, and every page looks exactly the same and you don't have to do anything in the Twiki editor, you don't have to know anything about Twiki, you don't have to care this is one of my this is one of my sample pages. This is started with the with the magic thing. And we've got stuff. And everything on here is either a button that you click, an edit table that you that you bump. Um, do you know about edit table, anybody? Yep. Edit table is another absolute magic twicky thing. It lets you edit a table without again going into the back and doing anything. Okay. If you've got a Twiki and you don't know about edit table, go back and learn about edit table because it's going to make your life so much better instead of worrying about all those little vertical bars and where the spaces go. All that's gone. Not only that, you get pull down menus, so that's really cool. Um, so we'll go back real quick. Still trying to get this. Uh, this is my, this is my, I've got three pages. If you know anything about database, this is a really, really simple database. And you've got to understand what I know about database fits in a spoon. Um, but you've got your form definition, which is your schema. You've got a query form here. You've got an indexing type thing, which is also my query. It does a full index, but if I want to look just some things up. And then you've got, what's the other one? Oh yeah, an entry. You've got data entry. You've got to have data entry. Um, so this is my tracking page. and. As you can see, we have, we can initialize, we can do a search, um, we can show you what we've already got, and one of the magic things I gave to everybody is that I only list by default all of the open projects, so the Twiki meetup um, hadn't happened yet when I put this together, but if I say that I want to see whether or not I have any closed projects, I can forcibly search for those, and so the Halloween party has come and gone, so that way you can, you don't have, right, today I asked somebody to please go through all of our actual projects and close any that she could, because I think we had 50 of them, and it turns out now we only have this many because nobody bothered to be closing them, but that way at least the list isn't so bad. So you go past all that, there's nothing to do here, and then down here's the form. This is the, this is the stuff in Twiki that Peter talked about with applications that makes everything so magic. And it took me, I am a Perl programmer, I am a programmer, I know how to do this kind of stuff, and unfortunately it took me a couple of days to work out how to do forms. It only took me about two hours to do the second one, and since then everything when all you have is a hammer, everything looks like a mirror. When all you have is a Twiki, everything looks like a form. And uh, I think we've got five or seven of them now because anything I look at seems like it ought to be. We've got the team directory. We've got four different copies of the project tracking for four different groups. Um, am I done? Did I finish? Well, the plugins all come from, come from Twiki, and I think you, that anybody can do a raw view of anything here without, log, without logging in. You have, to edit. you have to log in to edit, but I think you can probably do a raw view on all my pages.